Hi everyone. I told you I would come on here when I had been to my doctor's appointments. And first I want to tell everyone thank you for all your support. Thank you for all the new subscribers I've been getting. Thank you to all of you. Um, I felt fantastic all day today, um, all day yesterday. I spent the last two days an hour, hour and a half from my house. Um, yesterday I was with my mom um, in Boise and today I was with my husband and my son. Uh, we had three appointments, um, one for Spencer and two for us. Hi Dave. Yeah. Where's your hat? It's, in the, it's on the table. Oh. So anyhow, we um, went to maternal fetal medicine today and had the ultrasound done and the first set of blood work and then I go back in at 16 weeks and have the second set of ultrasound and second set of blood work done. And so today, um, have lots of ultrasounds to show. So get down to it. I just took a Zofran because I felt really good until we were heading home and started getting nauseated. And I've only been nauseated actually traveling the last couple days. So that's really good because I have been feeling really good. Um, so here we go. That's the first one. There's the head and the feet and one arm. I mean, she got really, really good pictures of the baby. Look at the leg there. I know. We had a hard time getting the legs um, measured and stuff today, but that's a really good one and these are the other arm see it says other arm and it's shoulder elbow forearm and hand <laughs> and arm did we freeze oh okay that's the first arm and hand And that says legs, right? Yeah. Legs. My arm's getting tired. And two legs. And there's the first picture of the baby. So, yeah. We got one, two, three, four. Eight, nine, ten pictures. Um, so from these pictures, this one's better. This picture was eleven weeks and two days. Two days. And this one. That's twelve weeks. No. Nope. 12 weeks and 5 days today. And we asked the doctor about why I'm getting further along than what we think we are week by week. And he said, don't listen to any of them. We go by the very first ultrasound. It is the most accurate. Your due date is April 21st, period. We're like, okay. Um, we talked about constipation. And he said Miralax over the counter. And a um, an over-the-counter uh, stool softener, maximum dose for me. Um, I do have hemorrhoids and bleeding. Um, he said perfectly normal. They'll get worse as the pregnancy goes on. We'll just keep an eye on them. Um, I'm retaining fluid in my hands and in my feet. 
I, you know how I told you guys I had all gained five pounds and um, six ounces? It's gone. I'm actually below the weight I was. Um, I've dropped seven, seven and a half, almost seven and a half pounds. So, it's amazing when you eat some apples and you Drink a lot more water. increase your fluid. And I've been walking. I know I've been getting comments and messages. If you walk, and I've been walking, I still walk up to two miles a day. We talked about exercise today. I have no restrictions. Unless I bleed, or unless I get out of breath, or I get dizzy, I just listen to my body. If a laundry basket is too heavy for me, and I get out of breath, then my body's telling me something. If I use weights, and I, you know, um, strength training, or whatever, and 10 pounds is great, and 20 pounds is too much, then listen to my body. That's, that's what he said. Your body will tell you your restrictions, unless something medical happens. Now, if you're doing the treadmill or the elliptical and you start bleeding, that tells you that you just can't do those. Um, the bleeding I had at the hospital, he said, sometimes that just happens. So, I'm feeling great. I am still a little tired, which is normal, and I am um, happy. <laughs> I'm so happy. Alan's so happy, and Spencer's so happy and he's been so good and I'm just amazed at the miracles that God can do <laughs> that God gives us and um, I'm thankful that everything is going good and I'm trying my hardest to do everything to the T and um, you're all on my mind and there are certain people that are on my mind more than others and um, that's just because I have more of a personal relationship with them but my laptop is acting up I can't watch any videos and I know you guys can't hear me when I do a video on the laptop so I've been trying to do them here and keep you guys updated um, uh, he wants me to get a flu shot in a week and then um, here in the valley he said a lot of doctors are not getting the swine flu shot only specialists are and some other doctors he tried to explain it to me but he said he is getting a lot of swine flu shots in and he wants me to get that at 16 weeks at my next appointment and he wants me to get a flu shot at one week and um, they're doing homework and I hear the Buzz, Buzz Lightyear Toy Story. Spencer, are you going to come and tell them what you're going to be for Halloween? And next video we'll show them your costume. Because it's hanging up in your closet, isn't it? Yeah. Look right up there. Um, in that little red dot. I'm going to be a Woody. I mean, a cowboy. Woody? Yeah, which from is Toy a Story. From Toy Story, and it is a cowboy. Mm hmm. Are you excited? Yes. Look at that dimple. It's just getting deeper. Oh, Daddy got it. Here, I'll just move it. <laughs> Show him the hat. There it is. Are you going to get you some boots? Um, I don't know if... And we got your gun belt with your fake guns that are going to go around your waist. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, so I'm going to get you some boots. Yeah. But, Spencer is going to have sweats on.